Well, Scousers don't get knocked out, and that has been the case for Patty Pimblett, at least to this point in his UFC career. Outstanding pedigree coming in, and he's got another big fight in front of him tonight, DC. And he's going to continue to get big fights, because when you have that thing, when you have that it factor about you, people want to tune in. That is what Patty Pimblett has in spades. But not only can he fight, not, I'm sorry, but not only can he draw people in, the guy can fight. He's a tremendous grappler, and he has confidence like not many guys that we've seen at such a young age in their career. And don't let the out-of-camp body composition fool you because this man has a work ethic that rivals anybody in this division. Huge spot for Patty Pimblett tonight. If any modern era UFC athlete is worthy of a Hall of Fame distinction despite having never realized a UFC title, I would submit to you Donald Cowboy Cerrone. His resume reads like a UFC record book. And he just keeps on getting better. Every time you think Cowboy is starting to get to the end of the rope, he reinvents himself. He makes some small change to his game that allows him to compete at the highest level. The run that he went on after beating Alexander Hernandez and then Coupling that with the massive victory over Ally Aquinta, you thought watching that you were watching the very best Cowboy Cerrone you've ever seen. And this is at the tail end of a career that spanned over a decade. And his new source of motivation, his son Danger, these are very legitimate championship aspirations for Donald Cowboy Cerrone trying to move one step closer here tonight. Donald Cerrone, the man many of these fight fans have come out to see here tonight. Our tail of the tape now for this lightweight championship fight. All right, now for the official introductions, we set it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Championship of the world. If you see first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Patty the Bad Pimpla. And now, if you see the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC. Lightweight champion of the world, Donald Cowboy Cerrone! Herb Dean is your referee. He's the third man in the octagon tonight. All right, so here he is, Patty the Batty Pimblet. You wonder if he could sell out this arena by himself. A lot of these people are here to see him here tonight, and he has been off to the races in the UFC thus far. Began his career with a couple of wins, both of them producing finishes and bonuses, but now there's an uptick in competition. Now the stylistic challenges get stiffer, and as humbly as Patty could say it, my game is ready. I have not been resting on my laurels. I've been going to Justin Flores and training my judo in California. I'm bouncing around getting the best looks. You're going to see a totally different version of Patty Pimble here tonight. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Rips the body there. And both fighters exchange in the packet. Landed a big kick there. Nice kick there by Pimble. Oh, big head kick there. Oh, look at the guillotine. The guillotine looks like it's locked in. Right now, he's got to be patient. He's got to squeeze, but not too much. He's got to get the guard locked and try to find a solution. Oh, he escapes. He got out. I mean, wow, that is great. 
elite submission defense. Pimlet's in half guard. All right, right into side control, upper body strength, attempting a choke now. Ooh, this could be it. That thing is tight. That arm triangle is deep. Good job by the champ Work. there. Sliding back out. Excellent ground and pound strikes here by Sue. Now he's going full mount. He's got the best. Oh, huge elbow. Oh, huge ground strikes. You cannot sit in this position. Referee will have no choice but to stop the fight. Oh, big, big shots here. All right, he continues to bully his opponent here, really manhandling him on the ground. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. And once he got to the top, he started to land brutal ground and pound until the fight was called off. Just a dominant performance from the top position. Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 43 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new UFC lightweight champion of the world, Patty the Patty. Take my money, DC. We got a new UFC lightweight champion. This is a belt that doesn't always change hands very often. There's a new king at 155 pounds. The most exciting moment in sports when Dana White wraps the belt around a new champion's yes. waist. Take a moment, son.